So, hello guys, Patrick here from Waveco. And in today's video, I'm gonna make a series. This one will be a series on how you create an account at Centipede, how you integrate all the payments, how you create packages. It will be a series, this is part one of the series. So, what is Centipede? What is ISP? So let's, let's, let's get started. An ISP, an internet service provider, is a person that provides internet to you. And if you're an internet service provider and you're looking for the best billing, uh, billing platform that can help, that's where Centipede Technologies comes into play. Centipede Technologies is a SaaS company. We deal with providing one of the best billing systems in town. So if I was to just click here on the Centipede billing system, they're actually the first link that comes. So let's click on that link. So it will actually bring you to the centipedebilling.com website for the Centipede Technologies. And here we have some few. Let's go over these um, websites and I will inform you on the Centipede features. So Centipede helps local ISPs uh, grow their business by automating manual stuff. Let's say like invoicing a client, uh, reconnecting a client upon, upon payment. That's where Centipede comes to play. So let's look. Here are some of the renowned trusted ISPs that use Centipede. So as you can see, we've come here. So let's look at one of the features that this has. It helps you uh, monitor real-time insights of the active users and also your finances. And it's time-saving. What do I mean by time-saving? It helps you for PPPO integration. You have hotspot management. You have automated billing. And if you need to monitor your devices, you have remote micro management over there. So these are some. Let's go, before we continue on the prices, why choose Centipede? Let me just show you the demo. So if you come here and view here demo, you will see it will actually bring you to the demo page. So I've actually logged in to this demo page before, but if it's your first time, the username and password for the demo account, it's demo, demo. So this is, look, Centipede has one of the best UI in the market. So if you can see here, you can, you can view your amount, you can filter. If you want to see your amount in weekly basis, you can filter over here. So one of the best UI, you can see here active users, a customer retention rate, and we'll go on this dashboard section by section by section by section, because I've said this is a series. So you want to create your account. You want to get started. What is the pricing model? What's our pricing model? Just come here and a pricing model and let's see. We normally charge 3% of your total hotspot revenue for that month. And what does that uh, payment plan include? You have unlimited micro ticks. You have no user limit. You have remote winbox management. You can choose from a variety of multiple payment gateways. You have multiple also SMS gateways. And also we offer you free email support if you need it. That's on the hotspot plan. What about PPPOE? We normally charge 0.25 USD or for the Kenyan market, it's normally 25 shillings per an active PPPOE client managed by the Centipede for that month. What do you get with this? You get also unlimited micro tick, unlimited users. You have no revenue limit. You have automated invoicing. You have automated payments. You have multiple payment gateways and you have real-time notification. So, something you need to note about Centipede, this one don't come on separate payment plans. It's actually included when you create your own account. It's normally baked in. So you have both Hotspot and PPPoE already in the same account. So if you need to use a Hotspot, you are off to go. If you need a PPPoE, you're also off to go. But if you need both of them, you're also good to go. Another thing about Centipede that I like is that we are open on what we are doing. So if you are to change on the change logs, you can see you can see what we have been doing, what is in actively development by our developing our developers, and what 
is yet to be done. So like this is the change log. As you can see, on August 4th, these are the features, like an example of the features that we, uh, that we included in our system. Now we support Nigeria, Ghana, South Africa, Kenya, and Cote d'Ivoire. And now for Microtik version 7, we moved from Open, uh, we replaced OpenVPN with WireGuard. So here is where you can keep track on what you have been updating on the system. If you need to offer feedback, here is where you can just come, write a feedback, or you have noticed a bug in the system. Here is where you can actually bring that bug so that you can fix it. You can see the process that, like an example, here is what is in process, and here is what that is yet to be sorted. So here, that's the best. I've never seen a billing system where you can actually see these. You have a change log and you are, can offer feedback. So let's now let's create an account. How do you create an account at Centipede? It's actually a very simple process. I'll actually provide the link down below. So let me just navigate to that link. So this is the link. If you click on the link that I've provided in the description down below, you actually get 14 days free trial. Centipede comes with 14 days free trial. That's if you use the link in the description. Just click on that link and let's create an account. So it will actually prompt you, as you can see, it has even the UI for creating an account. I've never seen a system like this. Now let's just use a sample email. So it will send a verification link to your email. So let me just open my email. Let me just open my email over here. As you can see, verify your email. So you have to verify your email. And we actually take security in mind because you can see here, this link will expire in 15 minutes. So no one can use your email to do anything fishy with your account. So let's verify my email. So it will actually now bring you to the second page where now, as you can see, 14-day trial. That's when you use now the link that I've provided in the description. It will actually prompt you to here set your company name, your phone number. It will select, it will prompt you now to select your country. So let's get started. Here I'll just choose a name like and because I'm actually ha I actually have an account so I'll just call this wave call that is wave call demo it will prompt me here to insert a phone number so for this one uh, I'll just use uh, my second phone number let me just set here a country so that I can retrieve that second phone my second phone number now is Kenya. Yeah, it's Kenya over here. Then here it will prompt me for to set my phone number. So let me just get that phone number. So this is the number that I got for this demo. Let's click on next. It will prompt you here to set your password. Uh, your password. So it, let me just auto generate. I can auto generate this. Let me just use this password, a strong password. Let me save it. Save as new. So this is the auto-generated password, but here you can set your own password. Then it will create an account. It's creating an account for me. So just give it like five minutes to create an account. And you can see I've successfully created an account. And if I was to navigate back to my email address, and here you can see, welcome to Centipede Billing. And this is my domain with codemo.centipedetechnologies.com. And this is the email address that I used. My username is this one. And the password is the one that I auto-generated. I'll actually replace this email. But I'll use, you can also log in to your account to just create an account. Log in. This is the username provided there and the password provided there. So let's just log into this account. I'll just come back to, just come back here, pick my username. I 
and then come pick my password, my secure password, which I will change after this video, before the video is dropped. Then click here, you can click remember me, just sign into your account. So here is the centipede, as you can see, we have Godemo, and this is how, when you create an account, this is how now the system comes. So in the second video, we we'll talk about now this dashboard, the entire dashboard, and how now you integrate features. We talk about what the active, active user section does, on the finance section does, on the communication, and even on the settings here, how to change from, let's say, how to customize now this dashboard. It will be on the second part of this series. So I expect you to, see, I expect to see everyone on the second video. Until next time, you've been watching WaveCore.